Did you decide to go through with a wedding despite misgivings? Were there red flags that made you fear the marriage wouldn't work? Why did you do it? Did the relationship succeed or end in divorce? When I was in my mid-twenties I dated a guy who was incredibly good-looking. When I introduced him to my friends their eyes would widen. OMG where did you find this hunk of a man? Dating him was fun, and the fact that we did not have a lot in common and had different priorities seemed secondary to the fact I was attracted to him. We got engaged in less than a year. I said yes, because I believed the following things were true. I am in my mid-twenties. It's time to get married. This is what people do and therefore what I am supposed to do. I really want to get out of my parents' house. Marriage is the only way out. This is cultural. I don't love this man but I will learn to love him. I had a sense that I was making a mistake and heading into a catastrophe but to me it was something I really wanted to just get done. Come on, Dushka, get on with your life. When I met him, he had just broken off an engagement to someone else. I think he was in a rush to get married for all the same reasons, plus a bit to get back at the girl who had just left him. This would show her. We got very distracted by the tangle and flurry of a wedding. I was too busy tasting frosting and picking my dress to notice there was a crouching future waiting for me on the other side. We got married and during our honeymoon I knew we were doomed. We had nothing to talk about. Oh my god Dushka get out. Get out before you lose the ability to listen to yourself. Get out before you learn to swallow your feelings. Get out before you decide it makes sense to settle. Get out before someone convinces you to save something not worth saving. Get out before you get pregnant. Get out. The thought of a whole life with him felt like a sentence. Like my ring was a noose. I summoned the courage to talk to him about splitting up about three months later. He was angry and shocked but I think mostly he was scared about what people would say. I was worried about what people would say too but not to the point of sacrificing my life in the name of public opinion. We got divorced eight months later. I don't think my divorce was a failure. I think it was a lesson. There are many, many things we believe are absolutely true and they are not. Question everything. You don't have to do that. You don't have to do anything. You don't have to get married. You don't have to buy a house. You don't have to have kids. The things that are right for others do not ever have to be right for you. It's your life, and you get to design it.